eat. I, I want, want us, us to, to make eat. Ghanaian food. Why not? Cook one. Yay! This is how excited I am when I'm cooking Ghanaian food or when I'm cooking Swedish food. You know something? It is so nice to eat your own food. My mom says homemade foods are always the best. So today we are going to make another authentic Ghanaian food. You are going to cook dinner with me, right? This is a traditional method. It's a quick and easy way to prepare food in Ghana. Boiled plantains with spinach stew. In Ghana, we use contumere or water leaves to prepare this stew. And it's a local stew. We are not going to fry, 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 fry. It has all the nutrients in it, all the vitamins. You get it direct, right? So, without wasting time, please, let's start. are the ingredients we are going to use to make our traditional spinach stew with boiled plantains these are the ingredients so here it is i placed it aside so i'm going to peel off the plantains I'm going to use two plantains. You can use as much as you want. So here I'm peeling off the plantains and I'm using left handed to peel it. That's how I do it every time, but you can use the right hand to do it as well. So here I was taking away the first skin of the plantain away and I cut the end. I don't like them, so I cut it. So here I'm going to slide them into pieces but you can give it any shape of your choice you can choose to divide it into two and cut them into squares but this is how i want it so i place it in a bowl a bowl with water and i take the peel away so here i was washing the plantains but it's not necessary you wash it and i'm going to cover it with a lot of water And the salt to taste so here i'm going to blend my onions the red onions and i've already blend the pepper with my tomatoes already because i don't like blending the pepper so here i added the spinach you can add you can use water leaves that is Moko moko, hum hum. you can use all of them. They are also green and contumery. So here I added my tomatoes that is mixed with the pepper. And I added my peanut butter and blend it. So I add salt to taste. The salt is always according to your taste. And I add little water because of the peanut butter, it has become thick. So I add little water for it to become softer. And I added the salmon, it's a, a toast salmon flakes. So here it's ready. So I'm making the pot nicer, the inside nicer. And here two tablespoons of palm oil and I pour in the shredded onions and I'm going to fry it. Here I'm removing the eggs from the plantains. You can use spoon to remove it so you don't burn yourself but I'm used to heat. So the plantain is ready. So I strain the hot water away. 